Hello, my lovely Pisces. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Pisces, welcome to this January reading. And this reading, mostly we are focusing on your finance, career, anything regards money, business, or even studies. For whatsoever loves, this is not a love reading or a family reading, and as you used to, it's quite different. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Let's see, loves, what we have right here as is a new day, is a new chapter, is a new year. And as well, today it's such an unbidding sun outside. I didn't see quite in a long time where I am right now and I feel the energy is quite strong also it's right before the new moon let's see Pisces how your finances will be this month of January keep in mind this is a general reading my resonate with you my do not take mostly what is yours loves okay there's coming changes for you. Okay? There's coming changes. There is choices. Underneath we have marriage here. There's coming changes again. And as the Spirit says, this month you might, you might feel that it's quite hard. Because I do see here some spending money instead of gain but it's kind of you gain freedom it's like losing money but but gain freedom for yourself you expect something here to to go fair share but spirit says it's better to not make it a fuss about it but the change is coming for you Whatever legalities you are dealing this month, don't expect somebody to be the truth or say the truth or be honest with you. I feel here you do expect that things will go very well. As the Spirit says, always, always, never, never lower yourself by any means. It's kind of whatever is changing this month is better way better and whatever you you feel like you lose which i don't feel you lose is in regard something in here this month spices way you work or with who you are dealing is it's better to to be persevering or cautious or set boundaries and also whatever is there to keep it mostly for yourself because not everybody is your best friend your good friend and I feel here there is something here you it's like I will not tolerate I'm moving forward to something new for some of you is a change of a job or a change of a career but it's like whatever is here, whatever you leave behind, you you feel there is still good hope. Spirit says is your right to fight for what is yours, but think if it's worth it, the effort or not. But let's see here. As many of you say, well, sometimes your readings are so positive and sometimes are so negative. But believe it or not, Pisces, I never consider a reading negative. What I consider those readings, you feel they are negative. They are for us to be prepared, to learn, and to evolve. And sometimes, that's why I'm saying these are predictions. Sometimes when those type of situation comes, we can change the outcome many times, just knowing how to make it forward Pisces Sun Moon Rising Signs and Venus Signs for January how your finances career anything regards money looks there three of cups 
Three of Wands, Ten of Cups, Six of Swords, Two of Wands, Seven of Swords, and Seven of Cups. Oh my goodness. All right, loves, and underneath we have this Five of Swords and the Hierophant. It's like somebody here jeopardize your stability. And again, Five of Swords and Seven of Swords, this is not your best friend or somebody here who wants the best for you. There's a choice here, you will make it. And there is movement. And it's like somebody here try to get something from you or steal from you, whatever it is. And because it's kind of like they, they try to benefit from it, well, they might need to think again. Because as I always said to each and everybody, you can steal somebody's wings, but you might not fly. You can fly with somebody else's wings. You might use them as a souvenir, but for what? And as you see here, we don't have any major arcanas. And only major arcana, it's right here after the Five of Swords. I feel here, as you know, when we don't have major arcana is the universe is telling you, whatever you are into, you can do it. You don't need the help from the universe. You don't need help from the angels or the other ancestors. Whatever is here, you know. You know what to do. And I feel here in the first week, the mostly, by the second week of January, there is indeed move. For some of you, this move is like a physical change or you leave behind something. So whatever you are, my lovely Pisces, I feel here could be, you know, somebody here looks like a friend or looks like a very good co-worker. Let me help you. Let me do this. But it's something here for them. For others of you, you choose to walk away from a job who is like the environment is not for you. And other thing what I'm picking up. As you move forward, there is coming plenty of opportunities here. Let's say here, Six of Swords, the way you are heading towards. Temperance, balance. It's like I have patience with myself. Too many cards here jumped out. And it's like, well, I need my peace. Whatever I am, I cannot find the peace, strength. And I can do this. I can overcome this. It's like your, your energy is, whatever I am is not for me. And you know, wherever you go. It's like you, you kind of know with this King of Swords, like I know what I got to do. I know I got this. And the environment is like somebody here. There's a Pisces who leaves an environment. It's like in the front, everybody's friendly. On the back is not. It's kind of somebody here. It's telling you good words, promise things. But in the back, it's just like, well, uh-uh. You know, two of swords. Thus the Spirit says, be open for change. Because whatever is changing is for your own balance, for your own stability. And Spirit says, the universe will provide you. Open it up. See the opportunities here. Seven of Cups. Full. A new chance. A new thing. Ten of Wands, leaving behind something in here, indeed, and moving forward. Nine of Pentacles, confident, loving, it's like, I know what I got to do. I know what I got to do. 
and the environment what I have doesn't make me happy five of swords clarify here please knight of pentacles queen of pentacles and moon and eight of pentacles underneath it's like you loves work or put effort into something here to benefit somebody else more than you and it feels like everything goes very slow and also you might stay in an environment because of the fear of tomorrow what could be tomorrow but spirit says you know deep inside what could be it's hard to believe now and it's hard to move when you feel like it's everything all over the place but spirit says we will help you seven of swords six of pentacles lovers chariot too many cards let's see ace of wands and two of pentacles and king of cups underneath seven of swords clarifying by six of pentacles lovers chariot there's indeed here a choice of i'm gonna move forward i am determined to move forward two of pentacles and ace of wands i'm not sure if this what comes to me is great but i'm moving forward there's something new here also spirit says take it slow this this month or don't take it everything personal whatever is there and don't make decisions by fear make them by your strength because you do know where your strength is there judgment that's your wake up call energy for you Pisces it's time for me to do something about this situation even is not a fair or a good one but it's not at the same time that you are you are fighting for something it's like you are a little confused what should I take next what should I go next but I feel here in a very short time you will know it's like you will know where you're going okay so here we are Pisces for some of you you are you are very concerned if I leave whatever I am doing now how will affect me the other part of my life you know not only the finances but you know family wise child energy ch children or how I will catch up with the things but spirit says be sure that they will be providing okay all right Pisces I hope this helped you to go through and if you really feel that this is your reading let me know and of course we'll see you next time namaste